Hi everybody, Merritt from thermal-medics.com. Just want to do a quick one here. Got a little ream split system, four ton unit out here in the Gilbert, Arizona, leaking. Um, hooked up gauges, got nothing going on, zero PSIG. Customer called me just with some more, wanted some more information. Had a local father and son company come out and offer them 900 wonderful dollars just to even start looking. So anyway, nitrogen tank hooked up. Look, we don't barely have even, what, 60, 70 PSIG. You hear the hissing coming out right in there. I see Big Blue's upstairs doing some leak checking also up there. But um, telltale giveaway sign is the oil. Kind of tough to see. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. A lot of oil all over that that uh, small tube. It's going out actually to a uh, pressure switch um, on the unit for uh, pressure reset. But anyways, basically that's it. And um, notice throughout the unit here on the floor, on the bottom, a lot of oil stains. A lot of dust, which you're going to see inside units. They're going to be dusty inside and dirty, but typically you don't see the oil sticking or the dust sticking to the oil. That's the dead giveaway when you got something going on. Also looking inside here, you look at the top of the run cap. It's kind of tough to see. I pushed my finger through there. Oily residue around, things like that. So um, that's your dead giveaway on lease when you're looking for stuff. Again, not a real tough one to find. Not going to be a tough one to fix. Um, just a little bit of soldering work. Hook up the vacuum and uh, get it going again to the customer. So... Anyway, thanks for tuning in, thermal-medics.com. Appreciate all the beers, guys, and keep it up. Have a good day.